Ngonia scolded my daughter because she arrested Silva. That means he's still very much interested in her. She's so desperate, as a matter of fact. She can do anything to take Ugonia away from my daughter. <sighs> you may be my daughter. It is time you sat up and took the bull by the horns before Seva takes us on our ways. <laughs> Babe, I couldn't believe it when I entered the office. So she, <laughs> she works in the office? She works as an accountant in the insurance company. And you said you saw a fan in there too. Oh, <laughs> I saw him. Did he recognize you? How could he recognize me? when all of his attention was just focused on her. I left immediately. I can't stand them. Babe, what are we going to do now? <laughs> you know, I was thinking while coming back. And then, I had this idea. But it depends on if you are capable. Oh, come on. I am capable of doing Anything, mm. anything at all. Really? Yes. So you better start talking because the lane is dangerous. Okay. Start talking. I'm listening. They call me a no fan. They say I'm adopted. Hey. What are you doing here? I should be asking you that question. Is this your father's house? To get upset, you will take your little silly self out of this house. Else, I'm forced to throw you out. Are you really mad? Please, please, Silva, do not display your foolishness once again. Don't even try it. What's all this? Oh, you actually slept here again? I did not just sleep here. He invited me over. I mean, he asked me to come stay with him because he knows my worth. <laughs> he knows I am not as cheap as oh you are. Oh my God, you wish. You know what? I'm not going to take this rubbish from you again. But gone are those days when I did, I will not do that again. Now you take your miserable self out of this house right now. And I would not say one more word. Get out. Get out! I'm going to let you get out. You're so bad. You're so bad. I am so disappointed in you. So after coming to beg me, after everything, you still stood so low to bring this thing inside this house? What is wrong with you? Maybe you just took it to your pillow like I can Oh, please shut the hell up. Uh -huh. Explain what? Mm -hmm. What are you explaining to her? You would do yourself so much good by telling this nitwit to get out of this house, else I'll push her out myself. Now you tell this whore to take her miserable self out of this house right now. Get out! You, you are a prostitute! You can't go home! I know you! You are a prostitute! 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 You are a Don't you fight me! Bring! Don't you stop! Can you stop? What's your problem? Leave me alone! Why are you holding her? Let her come and fight! Bring it! Stop holding me! Look at her eyes! Just don't let it be! I've got to cut her and cut on me! And you're telling me to keep quiet! For what? Please! Please! Oh. It's okay! Do not tell me that it is okay! Listen! You should be one of these adopted women should leave me alone! You made me stop talking! Why would I stop talking? What? Give her! Please! Come to me! Please! Try it! Please! Leave her! Don't try me! Leave her! Leave her! Leave her! Let her come to me! If you want me to stop, then you want her to stay away from my business! I mean, what nonsense is this? You know what? I think all these things have to stop here. 
I will be waiting for you at home. Oh. This thing that just happened to you here is just a tip, a tip of the iceberg to the real thing. Once you come back, we will continue from where we stopped. No problem. Don't, don't Rubbish. Yeah. You're waiting for me. Yeah. Yeah. You're waiting for me. You want another one? one? You're waiting for me. I will also. slap you again. You're waiting for me. I will miss this. Wait for me. Finish you. Wait. You will never get yourself please. again. Please. Even up water. You're asking me to be flat because of this. You're because of this. Rubbish. You are because of this. Man, turn that fire you. You're a very stupid woman. I do. You were here. This nickel poop had the guts to give me a cut on my face, what? and you get quiet. At least I left you for one minute. Don't you do what? what? Why didn't you stop me? Let me warn you. This should be the very first and last time this will happen. I won't take it. I'm just going to go in there, take my things, go to the office, have a change, and I'll meet the fool at home. Get away. Mom, she didn't tell me where she was going to. Okay. Go and get my phone. Let me call her. Let me call her with my phone instead. Mm. You can't believe what happened today. Can you imagine that I went to Gonia's house and I saw Silva there? She had the nerves to confront me and asked me to leave the house. Can you imagine? I'm telling you. But I'm waiting for her. Silva asked you out of Gonia's house? <laughs> Mom, I do not have water in my mouth. She asked me out. But trust me, mother, I dealt with her. Anyway, I trust you. And I know exactly what you can do. Mom, it's not done yet. I am waiting for Silva. Oh, she thinks she's smart. But I will show her another side of the game that she hasn't seen in her entire life. Stupid girl. Go ahead. I am solidly behind you. Thank you, mother. Hey, look at Silva. So Silva doesn't want peace to reign in this house. Oh no, she obviously doesn't want peace to reign. But trust me, sis, I will give it to her back to back, however she wants exactly. it. Exactly. Rubbish. Yes. Nonsense. Silva. Really? Look at Silva. <laughs> I know exactly what to do. I will place her where she belongs. Wow. An adopted child belongs to the orphanage home. Very soon, <laughs> she'll go back to where she belongs. She has no place in my own house. Did my mom just said that Silva was adopted? No, 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 no. Maybe she was just joking. But what if she was adopted? Mom! Silva is only desperate about Ogona because of his wealth. But I am so going to frustrate all her efforts. I sure will. Yeah. Oh, I, yeah. There are two women in my life. Yeah. I'm in love with one and the other of my kid. Hey, hey. Somebody tell me what to do. Hey, yeah. Because I'm stuck in the middle, I don't know where to go. Hey, there are two women in my life. Oh. I'm in love with one and the other of my child. Hey, somebody tell me what to do. Hey, yeah. Because I'm stuck in the middle, I don't know where to go. I don't know, oh, hey, should I tell Silva to go? Let's, let's put all these things behind us. Put what's behind us? I'm asking you, put exactly what behind us? You were here to maybe have to go 
cuts to come into this house to fight me. And even gave me a cut and you're telling me to put it behind. Behind what? Please leave me. I'm, I'm, I'm not saying we shouldn't push it further. Uh, let the sleeping dog lie. There is no sleeping dog in this matter. No sleeping dog. I'm just going to go in there. Pick up my things. Go back to the office. Take permission. And when I meet her at home, it won't be funny. Leave me. I somebody. Mom, are you okay? No. Mom? My son, I am not okay at all. I'm not okay. Why? I am hurting inside of me. I am, I am not okay. Your father is hurting me. He's making things very difficult for me. I'll call him, so I will tell him to stop hurting you. You will do that for me? Yes, mom. Listen, my son. I am going to call your father now. All I want you to do is to tell him that if he doesn't stop seeing Silver, that he will never set his eyes on you again. Will you do that for me? Yes, mom. Hello? Good afternoon, Dad. Good afternoon, my boy. How are you? I'm not fine. What happened? Did anyone trouble you? It's you. Why are you hurting mom? Mom, I've been thinking about the comments you made concerning Silver this morning. Remind me, please. Mom, you said that Silver was adopted. Is that true? Yes, it is true. Mom, but you said Silver's mother died after giving birth to her. That was a lie your father told me. But I later found out the truth. This is unbelievable. Is Dumebi aware of this? No, <laughs> but she will. She will find out too. I don't understand. Grandma! Oh, sorry. How are you, son? I'm fine, Grandma. Grandma, guess what? Oh. You know I can't guess. Just tell me, please. What is it? I spoke with Daddy today on phone. Okay. So, what did he tell you? I told him to stop seeing Auntie Silva, else he will not see me again. <sighs> Good! High five! <laughs> That's my grandson. I like your comments. Um, you know what? I will take me to buy something for you to do. Yay! Thank you, Grandma! Grandma, I love you! I love you, I love you. <laughs> I love you too. Grandma, let me go play with my ball. Okay, go. This is, this is so hilarious. What kind of a child is this? <laughs> hey! Imagine! Um, hey, stop. I'm beginning to enjoy this whole day. Silver has lost out for good. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. That boy said that to you? My brother, like, I could.
couldn't believe my ears. You need to hear the way this boy speak. I was shocked, like I'm yet to recover from the shock. He sounds so bold and so courageous, like you would think you're talking to an adult. He is amazing. I'm so confused, seriously, I don't even know what to do. Please stop calling me. Who? Sylvia. I need to get I need to get myself together. So what have you decided now? I don't even know. To tell you the truth, I don't know what to do. Because of all all, all these I, I I took my father back to the village when he was discharged from the hospital. Because I don't want him to witness all of this at all. Well, if you ask me, I will say the little boy has settled the case for you. How? You are asking me how? I don't know. That's what I'm asking you how. They call me an orphan. Why is he not taking his calls? I'm just calling to tell him I'm staying back in the office. He got the call. What is going on? Is he angry with me? I didn't do anything. He's still caught in a Something must be wrong. Leave me alone! Leave me! You think I'm a mother? What the hell do you think you are? You really want to kill me in this house? You want to kill me? Oh, really? Yeah, I am not a mother. You are not! I'm a bad mother. You are a bad mother. Where is your mother? Who wants you to have a Where is your mother? I don't understand. You are a bad mother. Where is your mother? 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 She doesn't know she's adopted. And she's here in my father's house trying to drag space with me. Space. It won't work. And you call me adopted. <laughs> well, my darling, that is a big lie. I am not adopted. <sighs> my father never made mention of it before he died. So, tell those lies to the mm. birds and not me. Do you know why? Do you know why? Mm. Because he never wanted you to know. That is a fat you lie! Said. It's a fat lie from the pit of hell. <laughs> you all want to gang up and deceive me. It won't work. It won't work, you are a heartless woman! It won't work! Enough of it! Enough of it! I can't stand here and watch you insult my mother! Have you gone crazy or what? Who the hell are you? Well, let me make this clear to you. If you think your mother is a good woman, advise her. It's a simple advice. Tell her to advise her daughter! She good! Very good! 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 Yeah! Clap me and I will do that again! Are you what? Are you stupid? Call me an orphan. They say I am homeless, and they try to take the only thing that gives me joy. No, or I will fight. I will fight if no one speaks for me. Why is he not taking my calls? I've been calling him since morning. Why is he doing this to me? What have I done wrong? I think I should call his second line. Switched off. Prince, what have I done to you? Why are you doing this to me? Uh -huh. Small things they don't they talk too much. If I talk back, they start to shout at me. If I shout, they start to fight with me. What have I done to them? I will fight and I won't quit. Till I get what we lost. Auntie, why are you crying? 
Or is it because I told Daddy to stop seeing you? What did you say? Yes, they always hurt mom because of you. So I called and asked him to stop seeing you. Will you stick your lazy silly self out of here before I take the living daylight out of you? Get out! I said get I'm lost! I'm Get out! Wait a minute. Could this be the reason Prince stopped taking my calls? I will kill this little rat! For your own good, please. To just go home, we'll see you tomorrow. Please. Uh, wait a minute. Are you asking me out of your house? Not necessarily asking you out. What's going on there, babe? Daddy. Oh, nothing. I'm sorting it out already. So now what? Oh, Sylvia. That, that, that is why I said for your own good that you should just go home. Oh. We have a visitor. So what exactly is she doing here at this time of the night? Daddy, I've told you to stop seeing Auntie Silva. You're hurting mommy again. Sweetheart, you don't have to stress yourself, okay? Because okay, daddy will have her thrown out. So let's go inside and wait for him. Hmm? Okay, mom. Hmm. Busy body. Oh, oh, oh. This is it. This is the reason you haven't been taking my calls. I'm sorry. She has my child. Stop talking nonsense! You proposed to me before you met her again! I proposed to her first before we lost contact. <laughs> Please, my love, I promise I will make peace between the both of you. Shut up! Let you make a fool of me. I'm good life. Yeah. Oh, I. Yeah. There are two women in my life, yeah. I'm in love with one and the other of my kids. I like the decision your sister took yesterday. Let me see how that idiot will boast again in this house. That one. I don't even know where she is. Are you saying she's not in your room? She's not, Mom. Okay. Guys, this is the height of it. And I've had it up to here. Whoever gave her that advice should wait for the repercussion because when it comes, you all in this house would regret it. What is your problem, Silva? I mean, why are you disturbing us this night? You want to know what my problem is? Sandra, I am asking you. You want to know what my problem is? Not to worry. When the time comes, you would know. Bunch of idiots. <laughs> Hi. Guess where she was coming from. Who could nice house, of course. And I suspect she met to maybe an ip ip gather. That is why she's boiling in anger. <laughs> Hi! This is just the beginning. 
She has not seen anything. Her mother will be in Zawata. We've been forecasting. My father said I was still very tender when my mother died. <laughs> that he had to remarry my stepmother so she could take care of me. I don't understand. Why would you tell them that you actually adopted? I don't I don't know. I don't know why they are doing this to me. And now my fiance is even complicating matters. What? What is happening between you and your fiance? Oh, please. He dumped me to be with my stepsister. Probably she told him that I was adopted. It is a lie. Have you discussed this with someone? Probably your uncle. Yes. Discuss this with who? I can't do that, Amanda. I'm even ashamed to do that. What if I was truly adopted? Sweetheart, you can't die in silence. You need to discuss with your uncle. Yes. I think he's in a better position because I believe he's the only one who will tell you the truth. Yes. They won't listen to him. I know them. Don't you have villagers? Do you want now, of course? Yes, they should look into all this. You don't need to die in silence, my dear. Please. Hmm? Oh? Just Zico, I, no, no, you need to tell somebody. I'm just tired. I understand I, your feelings. Eh? Don't discuss it with your uncle, please. Listen, I like that house. It's beautiful. I like it as well. I don't want to go back to our house. I want to stay in that house. Don't say that, sweetheart. You will have to come with me to our house, okay? Mom, I don't want to go to your house. I want to stay with Daddy. <laughs> hey, what hell are we a bicycle? What's wrong with you? Okay, you know what? Don't worry. I will be getting married to your father very soon. And once that happens, we will both move into Daddy's house together. Yay! Are you okay now? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> you wouldn't kill me, this boy. Mom, my phone is ringing. Yes, I can see that. <sighs> Hello? Yeah, this is do maybe. No, what is it? What hospital? What? When? Are, are you? I will, I will be right there. No, what is it? Come, come. Expecting anybody. Uncle. Your face is not bright. Is there any problem? What happened to you? My stepmother and her daughters did this to me. You mean Lola and her daughter did this to you? Yes. Come, come and sit down. You mean Laura and her daughter did this to you? Yes. What happened? Uncle, a lot has been happening in that house. I have taken too much. My heart is filled with so much pain right now. But the last straw that broke the camel's back is the reason I am here. Uncle, I need to know this. Was I adopted? Who said so? My stepmother said I was adopted. 
Please just tell me, was I? Laura opened her mouth and said you were adopted. Oh, God, that is the exact word she said to me. Was I adopted? God forbid. Uncle, she has told her children and the word has spread like wildfire. Everybody's... I mean, they're beginning to tell people. I need to know, was I adopted? You mean Laura opened her mouth and said you were adopted? Oh, Jesus. Uncle, please just tell me. Why is Laura this wicked? She has forgotten what she promised my brother. That she's going to take you as her daughter. Anyway, you were never adopted. You are part of our family. Your blood runs in our family. Laura must explain the meaning of this abominable comment. And I'm not going to take it lying low. She must explain. Anyway, just wait for me. Let me go. Something terrible just happened now. What is it? Do maybe just called me. She asked me to come to the hospital immediately. What happened? She said something like, um, Ugo Nail was shot by some unknown person this afternoon. God, I don't know. Is he dead? She didn't say. She just asked me to come to the hospital immediately. Who could have done this? Mom, I need to go to the hospital. I know what is going on right now. It's okay, just let me know when you get there, okay? Okay, mom. Oh my god, please. Let nothing happen to you. I'm Ziva. Uncle. Mm. This man here, yeah, what can you say? This is Mr. Okenman. He is our chairman. This is DK. Now, repeat before them what you told me in my house. Greetings, my elders. I am Lady Girlfors' daughter. I've been having problems with my stepmother and my stepsisters. And that is because my stepmother told her daughters that I was adopted. What? Aro! Come, they say this to a daughter of this land? Mba! Dike, wait. Mba! Eh, eh, look, why you Dike, wait, 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 wait. My daughter, go on, continue. Since then, we've been having issues. They've, they've been spreading this news around. Telling people that I am not part of the family because I was adopted. I had no choice but to come to my uncle to report the matter to him. Silva, are you sure what you told us just now is the truth? I'm very sure. My stepmother even threatened that I have no share in my own father's property. Hey! This is, this is wickedness of the first order. What is this? It's okay. You cool, man. We have had our daughter. We are going to take this case off. It's a serious one. We are going to handle it immediately. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Support it. Support it. Thank you. Um, Omonam, please. I would want this matter handled with utmost dispatch. This is getting out of hand. Don't worry. No problem. Um, we are going to. Send for you very soon. You get a message. Hmm? Don't worry, sir. You can go with that. Thank you very much. Vicky! Vicky! Yes, Papa. Come here. Come, come, come. Have you called your brother, Mr. 
I did though, but he's not taking his call. Call him again. I want to ask him here if he has gone to see the parents of that young girl he brought to me here the other day. I'll do that later, but I'm doing my assignment. Call him, yeah, we'll call him now, not later. Call but, him. but why are you so obsessed with all this issue? Who Gonya will tell you when he wants to go and meet them? Look, I'm interested in that lady. Is that clear? And I want my son to marry her. So I don't want stories. Is but that clear? Avet, let me go and get my food. Yes, but I do. Imagine. This is something my son would have done the marriage, uh, traditional marriage arrangements all this while. If not for the accident I had, eh? I have to pressurize him to get this thing done now, so as soon as possible. Now that I'm alive. Do not be troubled, my daughter. Eh? Our kinsmen are handling it. What have I done to my stepmother? What wrong did I ever do to her? What? She's just been unnecessarily wicked. I wish your mother did not die. She was a kind woman. So good. I remember my dad used to say that a lot. Oh. I remember that Black Thursday. Your father came back from the city. And I came to see him. Oh my way, oh my way! Ah, that man is too much! Sorry. 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 Just manage, manage, okay? Manage. Manage. Ah, it's sorry. 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 sorry, manage, please, manage. What is the matter now? Please, I'm about to be car, please. Okay. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Rose, it's okay, sorry. Where's the key? Open the car, open the car. Sorry, sorry. Oh, mother, hurry up and take me to the hospital. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Open the car. Ah. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Sorry, huh? Sorry. Sorry. Oh, oh. Go to the front, go to the front. Go for let's go. Hey! Sorry, no, sorry, 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 sorry. Hey. What's happened? What's happened? Uh, what I, don't happened? Know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I'm sorry. Uh, I'm coming. Uh, Let me check you. Uh, uh, get my car. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming. No, oh, I'm coming. Uh, I can't see. Yeah. Hey. Oh, my God. It's okay now. What is it? Sorry. Sorry. Uh, oh, it's coming. Okay. Sorry. Mm. Oh. Oh, sorry. Oh. What is that now? Oh! What's happening again? Uh, what happened again? I don't know. My body head, everything in that. I don't know. Let, let me check again. Get the oh. cup! Oh. Start it again. Start it again. Mm. Hey. On the walls. Huh? Please. Go, 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 go,
What's going on now, friend? Mr. Man, I've told you to calm down, please. Well, calm down, calm down. We have here. Yeah, yeah. Here. Nurse, how is my wife? Has she put to bed? No, sir, she has not put to bed. Up to now. We have been here since one hour. What is happening, nurse? She's okay. Sir, the doctor wants to see you. The doctor wants to see me. I hope all is well. It's not because of our lamp. It's gone. It's Come down. I'll wait till then. I start waiting for the doctor. Okay. Go and see him. She'll be fine. What is happening now? Huh? What is happening? I've not seen my brother since two hours now. Huh? Even the nurses are not saying anything to me. What is happening now? What is this? We talk about one another. Hi. What is happening? There is no problem. But you are worried. Doctor just look out for serious. Operation? Yes. Ah! You can't follow me? I just signed some papers that happened. And I have deleted the fine for her. Don't worry. She'll be fine. She'll be fine. Don't worry. Hmm? Let's go inside and sit down. No. I, I, I don't understand why this is happening to me. I don't understand. Some days after that, okay? Calm down. She'll be fine. I never, I never see this coming. I never see it coming. She'll be fine. She still have a week to her delivery. My brother, we have gone. She'll be fine. Let's go inside. Sorry. It's okay. Let's go inside. Let's go. The baby girl. I told you, she made it. Thank God. How are they? I'm so sorry. She didn't make it. Doctor, I don't understand. Who didn't make it? My wife or my baby girl? Which of them? Your wife didn't make it. We tried our best to save her life. But due to the prolonged labor, really affected us. So, Doctor, Doctor, calm down, 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 she died without even seeing her child. Yes. It was so devastating. It was a rude shock to us. Your father could not bear it. One year after her burial, I advised my brother, as your father, to take another wife who will look after you. And that was how Laura came to live with us. Oh, mother. Mother, I love you so much. Even if I didn't get to meet you, I love you. Oh. My brother, don't cry, huh? Not cry. Please, this is not easy. It's okay. It's not easy. I thank God you are now grown. <laughs> At least you continue from where she stopped. Yeah? That's our consolation. It's okay, don't cry. Please.
just had to say. What? You heard me. He's waiting outside. The prince is here to see me. Why is she pulling my legs? He's still outside waiting for you. You wouldn't keep him waiting. I, I heard you. Oh. Do I look up? Oh, never mind. She's the murderer. What? Arrest her. My prince, you have to listen to me. You know I would do anything to hurt you. Why in God's name would I want to murder you? I didn't do anything. This is all a setup. Possible. I didn't... Listen, she's evil. Young woman, you are under arrest for attempting murder on this young man here. I didn't do anything. Madam, the, the thing is, well, when you get to police station, you, you can explain to them. Exactly. But for now, you have to go to the police Madam, station. Madam, you have to remain silent. Or anything you say or do here, will be used against you in the court of law. Move it. Move it! Take it! Please! Take it! Please! Me and no fun They say I am homeless And they try to take The only thing that gives me joy No, or I will fight I will fight if no one speaks for me, I will speak for myself. I will fight, I will fight. No matter what it takes me, I will get what is mine. Oh, small things they don't they talk too much. If I talk back, they start to shout at me If I shout, they start to fight with me What have I done to them? Uh -huh. That is good for her, Mama She wanted to kill Prince because she knew she has lost him <laughs> They will take her to court And jail her for life Let her go and sleep there, idiot So, what is what doing is what doing well. The woman in there is not the one you brought to me the other time you came. I mean, the one we were supposed to go and see her people before I had that accident. What happened? Um, Papa, it's, it's a long story. It's not what I'll start telling you here now. I'll tell you when next I come back. My son, women are dangerous. 
especially when it comes to disappointment in marriage. Make sure whatever happens, the fault is not from you. I know what I'm talking about. Is that clear? Very clear, brother. So, that's good. Mother, oh my goodness. That man is such a nice man. He accepted me wholeheartedly. Hey! Thank God. Nikolanya. Hmm. So you said he took you to his new house. Oh my goodness. You needed to have seen the house. His new house is sophisticated. Beautiful. Really? Yes. Hey. Oh my God, I'm so excited. And, oh no. Let me give you the most interesting part of the whole story. Please, please, please say it. We are enjoying every bit of it. Oh my dear. They will be coming on the 24th of this month to see hey. you, mother. Eh? Yes! It's again. Oh. They'll be coming to see you! <laughs> I'm telling you! I'm so happy for you. Everything is so smooth. This is good wow. news. Thank you, mother. Thank you. <laughs> by someone's presence. <laughs> Do you know I've forgotten that this idiot is still in this house? Same here, me too. I don't even know why Ugonia ended that case. Eh? She deserves to go to jail. Mother, Ugonia is not a bad person. But he did one thing which I really liked. Bringing her to sign that undertaken at the police station is very, very important. But well, he should have at least allowed her to suffer small inside that jail. Exactly. Mother, we shouldn't be talking about this girl. She's not important. She's not. The most important yes. thing right now is that your daughter will be getting married to Gornaya. Wow. Isn't that amazing? And I am not win. Yes, mother. Yes, mother. Yes, so. <laughs> See, I am homeless and they try to take the That woman never wanted my happiness. She lied to her children that I was adopted. Dumibi also told Prince same thing. Now Prince has taken heart to his father. What did he tell his father about me? I must find out. I will fight No matter what it takes me I will get what is mine Oh Small things they don't they talk too much If I talk back they start to shout Here you are Here you are Planning another evil I told them I told them that I was not comfortable with undertaking taking me inside at the police station. Here you are. Heaven knows I had no hand in that attack against the prince. You and your daughters framed me up to achieve your selfish aim, right? You lied from the beginning. <laughs> so I'm not surprised. I am not surprised you're still lying to you now. But you know what? Your days are numbered in this house. Very soon. I mean, very, very soon. You will pack your things and go back to the motherless baby's home where you were adopted from. Oh, well, thank you. Thank you for reminding me once again that I was adopted. I'm glad to hear it. One thing I want you to do is that two of your daughters put together and not better off than I am. And you know it. <laughs> really? Interesting. Very interesting. Were you not there when mom apologized to Silva? She was forced. I mean, was it not glaring? Oh, you seem to have forgotten who Silva is. 
she was in the village before our arrival. So there's every possibility that she must have gone to bribe those men. I don't think it is so. Siva was not abducted as just as mom told us. Oh please. 